disappointed because obviously Clayton's one of the best guys in the 800 for US United States. So we're not bringing the strongest team there, but you know, things happen. He wanted to do the double and it just didn't work out for him, unfortunately. How important is this moment for you, especially after not getting the last It's very important. I have a lot of people doubting me. Gordon didn't doubt me though. You called it! Yeah! <laughs> he called it. He was one of the few guys that called it. And I'm just really thankful for all the supporters that help me get through this. My coach really helped me out mentally. Just called myself to get the win today. No, it's not, it's not a season best. But I still have that huge record in NPR. Um, I get to go home to see my friends and family. I haven't been waiting to do that for a while. So I'm going to go home for maybe a week, few days. Whereas this is my first time going around, so I really have to make sure my body get the proper recovery and just get ready for some diamond leagues and then worlds. What's the superior confidence? It does wonders. You know, I, this is my first big win since running for Nike, and I just really want to prove myself that I'm worth what they got me for, and I'm just worth running in the Nike uniform. What are your thoughts on the top two booth being could have been sophomores in college? I mean, it's great. I mean, you got Simmons that just retired. Dwayne, I don't know when he's coming back, but he's a hell of a runner. And you got all those guys in between, but I feel like the ones that are making the most noise are the ones in lower or college at least. What did your coach tell you to do today? What was his advice? I gotta do the PG version of what he told me to do, but he just he just said I gotta get out there, you know, run like hell, get my second position like I usually do, and when I feel like I'm ready to go, I gotta go. There's no second second downs I have to go and just, and just be ready. Looking okay, back on these past three races, are you gonna make any adjustments for the next three races after this I mean, no, I know I'm scared a lot of people coming in third. But I knew the first round I'd get through on time. The second round, I just kind of ran stupid. And then once I knew I got to finals, I'd get a London spot. I don't know how I do for position wise, but I just knew if I could make finals, I could make my team do London. So the first round, you really thought you were getting in on time? You weren't nervous? Or? I, was, I was nervous. Really? Were you nervous? What? Were you nervous? I was nervous for you, yeah. yeah. I was nervous. <laughs> So I want to see the best guys in the final, and yeah. you know, after last year, I was like, "What's he doing?" Because it yeah, looked like he let up a bit, you know. Like, yeah. and then was your coach fine with you not getting in the top two in that first round? Because, or he he's like, he, "What are you doing?" He might have, Did he give you a few he choice words? Some some words, some, some choice of words. He probably could use differently, but words I, I just, so he was nervous. Yeah, so he words was of wisdom. Nervous. I guess he just said, I can't, "I can't scare him like that." I'm giving him a heart attack for the little hairs that he does have. I'm giving him great hairs, uh, but. Yeah. Any extra motivation this year since you didn't advance very well last year in the trials um, after, after great NCs? A lot of motivation. You know, I just really wanted to prove myself. A lot of people just don't really think I deserve the spot to be here. And I just really wanted to show that you know, I'm 20. I'm one of the youngest dudes to make 800 in a long time. You know, Clayton was 20 at the time, but I think I'm a little bit younger. And um, I just really wanted to prove myself. You know, I, I knew I could do it. My coach knew I could do it. My teammates knew I could do it. But you, you guys just said I could do it. What's your schedule now up through London? Um, I'm going to go home, see my friends and family, take a proper recovery for rest because I haven't ran three rounds ever before in my life and just get ready to compete in some Diamond Leagues and then try, try to get a medal at London. Yeah. Yeah, what's the difference? Have you, have you thought about what you need to do from where you are now to get on the medal stand? Um, not really. You know, I was really focused on USA's. You know, it's too steep a competition just be blowing them off like that. You know, there's really great guys here. And um, so yeah, I was really focused on USA's. All right, good luck. Thank you. All right.